So, were you going to tell me you were bailing on date night, or did you expect me to wait at the restaurant for an hour first? No, we passed concern a while ago when you started declining my calls. You were still liking posts, though, so you at least had it. You were just blowing me off. No, you're not even dressed. You're still in your sweats. Oh, gee, what gave it away? Of course I'm mad. I don't like being stood up, okay? Especially not by someone who I thought really liked me and I really like them. Then explain it to me. I'm all ears. Yeah, tell me the reason. I am willing to listen if you're willing to talk. Hey, do you not want to do this? Look, I thought... I thought these past few months were going really well. I felt like we had a connection. But if you don't think so, if you want out, all you have to do is tell me. Yeah, we can end this. Walk away. What I want is an explanation. You're just standing there staring at me. Talk to me. Tell me something. Anything. Fine. You don't want to talk? Fine. Silence speaks volumes anyway. I'm leaving. Clear I'm not wanted here. <sighs> what is going on? Because there's something else, something deeper, and frankly darker. You've never blown me off before. You've never ignored me before. If I didn't make you mad, then what? What did you just say? You're not worth it. I don't get it. Whoa, 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 slow down. What the hell are you talking about? A burden? You're not... Hey, stop. You're talking a mile a minute and I can't keep up. Hey, take a deep breath. No, you're not. You're shaking. Take a deep breath. Good. Another one? Sit down. Better? All right. So, what are you trying to tell me? I heard that. You're not worth it. Worth what? Why would you say that? Well, it's not obvious to me, so explain it. Okay, so you woke up depressed, and you thought you could pull it together, but you couldn't. Why didn't you just tell me that? So you made a decision then, without talking to me. Do you know me that little? Look at me. You are not a burden. Not to me, not to anyone. Eh, let me finish. I love you. I... No, we haven't been dating long, but ever since I met you, I... <sighs> You're going to make me say lots of sappy stuff. <laughs> yeah, I know you like that. The cuddles, the sappy talk, and I don't mind telling you that. It's just... You need to talk to me. When you feel like this, tell me. Don't make executive decisions. Because I can decide what is or what is not right for me. And right now, you're exactly what I need. Afraid I'm not lying, love. So tell me next time, alright? Promise. Good. Then should we get some takeout? I figured I'd stay here with you. Date night in. Unless you want to be alone. Alright. Let's scoot over. <sighs> so, what do you think for dinner? Pasta? 
Yeah, I could go for some Alfredo. Come here. Hmm. You comfortable? Alright, food has been ordered. So, do you want to talk about it? Whatever brought this on? Really? Ugh, I'm sorry. She was out of line, though. No one should say stuff like that. Especially not family. No, it's not okay. It doesn't matter if she was joking or not. Words hurt. But newsflash, she's wrong. You are a great person. I'm not just humoring you. I'm serious. You work hard both at your job and in your life. I mean, you're always juggling different projects. I don't know how you manage it. You don't need to make excuses for your feelings. It's okay. Today is bad. Tomorrow will be better. Mm. Kisses do help. Cuddles too. <laughs> yeah, you bring out the sap in me. Never said things like that before, but it's not a bad thing. All right, let's find something to wash before the food gets here, okay? Cool. While there is still no word on a cure for the virus, government officials...